Hi, Pause with Cause fans. We're pleased to let you know that we're starting a video series. This is going to feature semi-notable, somewhat famous folks in your community. Thanks to Everett Mall as our sponsor, and also this time we'll be honoring Perfect Pals, our shelter of the month. Join us as we also salute Celia Chavez, a local girl who's gone on to become famous as Petty Chavez. Join us today and have some fun. Welcome everybody to Pause with Cause Studio at the Everett Mall. I am with Steve Bass. He's an Alaska airline pilot. Welcome to Alaska Flight 123. So up to Dallas, Fort Worth. We appreciate you coming with us here. I'm your captain, Steve Bass. First officer is Alex. And our flight attendant today would be Karai. We're going to give you great service today. You expect a smooth flight. Appreciate you coming with us. And you're going to find that Alaska airline pilots do not require painting skills to be hired. <laughs> so I'm brand new. This will be a chore. Well, that's actually why we have you here, because you've not painted before. And we want to show everybody just how easy it is. So easy, some guy who flies a plane for a living could do it. <laughs> also, you may see Randy. Randy is one of hey, our Randy. volunteers. Hi. Hey, Randy. And he's also helping us keep safe distancing today in case we have people who come in and want to see what we're up to. So thank you all for being here. Okay, Steve. Here we go, Alex. This is it. All right. The fact my wife and I, Lisa, we have six cats. I've got to paint a cat. <laughs> so... Uh, this is Lena from Perfect Pals. Yay! And it's a, a pretty complicated picture, so we're really going to see how that works out uh, compared to the white canvas. So yep. at the end, you'll get to compare. And the first thing Steve asked me was, is there numbers on these? I need numbers. This is going to be harder than landing in a no-visibility runway. Yeah. Windy conditions. Go. This is going to be pretty tough, but okay. fun. I think you'll be fine. Okay. All and right. I'm also going to do a cat today, and I am doing Christy from Perfect Pals. This is all about getting the shelter pets seen outside the cages and in everyday places. Well, here we go. Let's start painting. All right. What I think is that the first thing you should start with is eyes. All right. And the thing I like about the eyes is that means the animal's looking at me, and we both give each other a lot more respect that way. So my kitties are oogity, 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 and er, 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 and er chose her own name. What is it? Arr, arr, arr. She says it every day. So I love your eyes and we're ready to move on. So what happens to all these paintings that we do? First of all, especially a first-time painter, might be so thrilled that it turned out so well that they'd want to keep them, and we encourage that. Secondarily, we place them here at the Everett Mall in our artist studio, okay. or we have 21 hallway galleries. They may be in doctor's offices, they might be in vet's offices. Um, we actually have nine Fred Meyers, and I call them hallway galleries, but in the Fred Meyer case, they're bathroom hallways. We have a website, pausewithcause.org, Thanks for asking. And you can Segway. Yeah, you can see them there or you can buy them right at the Fred Meyer and we use cashless apps. And what's the cost? Uh, it's donation based since we're a 501c3. Okay. So you can, if you love a picture and you want me to work with you on a sliding scale, I absolutely will. We suggest 20 to $30 and 85% of all of our income goes back to the shelters to help the pets. We cover our costs. And then the 15% that I didn't talk about is going into an endowment to start with mobile vet units. For spading, things spading, neutering. neutering, and in poor and impoverished areas. Oh, and okay. our mom, my mom's favorite, by the way. Oh, perfect. Those so shoes tell me, in confidence. In confidence. Yeah. Then Nobody knows about that. No. I neglected to offer you a apron, although you haven't gotten too dirty yet. I'm okay so far. That's pretty good, but I had a baker's apron for you. Okay, that's option one. Option one. And then we have these lovely cause with cause aprons, which you could also use. Option two, those option are very two. nice. Or we now, I noticed you asked for a picture of me for my wife. I wonder what that was for. Oh, I wonder what that was for. Yeah, I don't know what she sent you. But, Let's see. But what? Well, she What'd said, you use that picture for? What is he going to look like in the... That's what it was. Okay, I wonder if there she sent you, you the go. beach picture. Okay. Funny. I still have those red trunks, by the way. Do you? Okay, nice. And I'm sure that they still fit. They, they do. Yeah. 
So we're deciding which one? Oh, uh, we'll do the paws. Hey, fabulous. Thank you. Okay. Okay. And uh, since we're doing a commercial break here for a second, I will also talk very quickly about the paws with cause. Sit, stay, and play at home. We have a new product for Paws with Paws, and it's sketching and painting with us in a box. So you can order these online at pawswithcause.org, and we will ship them to you, or you can pick them up curbside here at the Everett Mall. All right. And you can order the whole kit, which comes with a pre-sketched picture, a color picture. It also has everything you need to be an artist. We have a paint set for you, an apron like the one that Steve turned down, a palette. We've got three brushes of varying sizes, a picture, and your sketch. And of course we've got a helpful tip sheet since we can't be there with you. We show you how to use a color wheel, and then some tips, and then we also talk a little bit about eyes, which is what we've done first. Ah. You can order an extra canvas to go with your with your box. We are suggesting $20 for this as a donation and then $10 for an extra canvas. Okay, we're going to have a little fun here. And okay. I have made a Magic 8 ball. Mm -hmm. But it's not the way that you used to think of it when you were a kid. This Magic 8 ball doesn't give you answers. No. It asks you questions or to perform tasks. But All right. It appears you are an excellent house, house husband. husband. Uh, that's my wife, Lisa. She lost <laughs> a little bit of weight recently. But uh, anyway, she has her head on my shoulder, and we're we're just doing to a, what is the Top Gun song? Um, oh, Danger Zone? So I didn't know if you were going to do a pole dance or what? Folks, none of this is rehearsed. You do get the quest, uh, asked that question as an airline pilot. What scares you the most, or are you ever scared? Uh -huh. and, and the answer is that you're not really scared, but you're just aware sometimes. Okay. If you're going into Juno, high winds, uh, icy runways, yeah. you just become a little bit more hyper aware of what's going on. Uh, take your time. Mm -hmm. You know, there's no rushing. As I, I used to tell Copas, you know, we don't, if, say we're going to Seattle to, to Dallas, we don't have to land in Dallas. We just have to land somewhere safely. Safety is everything. Nice just to get hear. the plane down, get everybody down on the ground. Uh, if it yeah. happens to be where we're supposed to go, then that's a bonus. And turbulence is nothing that scares people. And, and honestly, these airplanes are built way overbuilt for turbulence. Uh, you're not going to crash from turbulence. It's just, it's just not going to happen. Uh, it's just uncomfortable. What made you decide to go into the airlines? I went into the Air Force first. Oh. I was a navigator on a C-141 cargo airplane out of McCord. And I did that active duty for seven years. And at the same time, I got all my flying ratings and then got out in 1989 and did the flying thing. But I went across the street to the Air Force Reserves uh, as a navigator and did that for the next uh, 17 years in the reserve. So I had 24 years total wow. uh, military service. Wow. Which Hollywood producers is, is going to see this? Is there anybody, am I going to become famous uh, in Hollywood or anything from this? Fuller, kind of yeah, fuller, Yeah, it right? just needed to be a little fuller, even yeah. though that cat doesn't have that. Okay, sure. We still have to. Okay. All right. All right. You're so close to done. We're is so there, close to done. You this are. is where we're at Is there so going to be a... We're not on camera yet, you know? Oh, we're not. I didn't we're know. We're not on camera yet. You are. Oh. Even though the picture's one thing, Yeah. take your artistic license and do what you want to do. I'd make this an airplane. But anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Pantomime in 40 seconds how you became a captain. Taking flying lessons. <laughs> Landing. Walking out. On my hat. Uh, captains have their little scrambled eggs on top here. So we'll pretend like these are scrambled <laughs> eggs. There's my captain hat and crew meal. Nice. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Would you like a high lift maneuver? <clears throat> so I'm Bob Ross in this thing. Happy little accident over here. And folks tell you, this is, the, like I said, my first time painting it. This is actually kind of kind of fun. I challenge Greg Ortega to paint a better kitty cat than me. We'll make sure that gets in. And I didn't pull out the glitter. Can you believe I didn't pull out the glitter? I just feel like glitter should be on everything. So this cat is... <coughs> Luna, and she is at Perfect Pals. 
in Arlington, Washington. And you can go to our website and see Steve's picture. We will post it on the website, probably on Facebook too. No. Yeah, why not? And then also we will have an opportunity for you to buy merchandise that looks like Steve's Kitty Luna. And I'll put up a list of the things that you can buy, but definitely t-shirts. Maybe a t-shirt with Steve and his kitty, if he would be so kind. Sure. As to let sure. us take one. I think you're done. I think we're done. I think would you we're like done. to show your painting? We're good. All right. Okay. <clears throat> this is the, uh, the, the picture that I'm going to paint, and this was my painting here. <laughs> So I, I did pretty nice on my yes, painting. Yes, you did. I even framed it with some plastic. Nice. Well done. Uh, 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 I mean, I, I, I took some artistic liberty to go from here to this. Yeah, uh, you did. Uh, it's but, a little different. There we go. Yeah, but your photorealism is quite stunning. Yeah. <laughs> well, Mr. Bass, Captain Bass. Oh, yes. Thank you very much for coming Appreciate and joining it. us at Paws with Cause. <clears throat> yeah, we folks, I'll order your box of paint for $20. I think you'll actually have a nice time doing it. Yeah, it was fun. It was. Yeah. It was good. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, thanks. Okay, high five. Right. Okay. Distant zoo. Distant zoo. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> thank you. All right. Bye. Say, lucky at cards, unlucky in love. And if you're lucky with your heart, then you won't have two coins to rub. And if I had a son, I'd say. When it all comes down in the end, my boy We all think that love holds sway But be lucky with your friends Be lucky with your friends Be lucky with your friends God we used to trust Now no one believes anything But your possessions will rest And the land of the blind With the one-eyed king uh -huh. And if I had a son I'd say when it all comes down in the end, my boy, get on your knees and pray to be lucky with your friends like I was. Lucky with your friends, be proud of them. Lucky with your friends.
lucky with your friends like I was. Be lucky with your friends, be proud of them. Lucky with your friends. Hey, thanks for watching our video today. Didn't Steve do a great job? You can look forward to more videos from us coming up soon. Do you love that picture of Lena from Perfect Pals as much as we do? If so, we've got merchandise for you, or merch. You can order that picture of Lena on socks, totes, face masks, or even phone covers. And let's not forget Petty Chavez. What an amazing sound. Hey, artists of all types need your support these days. If you'd like to get a copy of Lucky at Cards, please join Celia and Simon's Spotify channel and download this single play as well as their other songs. And lastly, if you want to get more involved with shelters and pause with cause, please order our sit, stay, and play at home box and join us to do more good. You can find out more about us at pausewithcause.org.